Tankers, this is Mobius Y speaking. This short video covers a must-know tip that every player should know. Stop spending gold to train your crews in new tanks. Keeping your crews well trained in your new tanks is important. Untrained crews severely hamper the performance of that tank in battle. They don't turn as quickly, the gun reloads more slowly, and your weapon's accuracy will be noticeably worse than normal. For a modest sum of silver, you can keep your tank crews trained at 100% efficiency even in a new tank without having to pay for the crew's retraining with gold. All it will take is some extra time before transferring your crew into a new tank. Normally, when you purchase a new tank from the tech tree, the game prompts you to move a crew into it. Instead of recruiting a brand new crew, it is recommended you simply transfer over the crew from the previous older tank you were just using and into the new one. This allows you to keep using the same crew as you progress into the higher tiers, and the more you use that crew, the better it gets through training multiple skills and perks. These skills and perks provide useful bonuses to your tank's performance. Whenever your crew completes training on a skill or a perk, the game notifies you in two ways. One of them is by marking the crew with a golden glowing plus icon that appears in the right hand side of your screen. This icon also shows over the crew commander's portrait. When you see this icon, you can pick a new skill for the crew to start training. However, if you just bought or are about to buy the next tank down the line, do not pick a new skill for the crew. Instead, keep playing your old tank in more battles. You'll want to earn roughly another 25,000 tank XP before transferring the crew. Once you have done this, you can transfer your crew. Unlike with recruiting new crews, which can be done for free, transferring an old crew into a new tank requires a cost either in silver or gold. This cost will differ depending on the tank's type and battle tier. Pay for the crew's transfer in silver and you'll see that despite paying for the 25% training option, your crew will be trained in their new tank at 100% efficiency. This technique is called overtraining and it only works on crews that are ready to start training a new skill. Overtraining not only ensures that you can use the same crew in newer tanks, but it also ensures that as you climb into higher tiers, you won't be using newer, untrained crews repeatedly. Instead, you'll have one crew that has accumulated several skills and perks and will perform at 100% efficiency in every tank you play as you make your way down the tank line towards tier 10. That's it for this video. I'm sure most veteran tankers knew about this handy trick, but if this knowledge is passed on to every player we know in the game, the chances that it will help someone improve substantially. And more importantly, it could very well help someone's wallet as it gets them to stop spending their gold unnecessarily. Why pay money for something you can do for free? If you would like to see an in-depth video on what each crew skill and perk does in the game, check out my tactics talk for crew skills and perks. It is a fairly long one, but it goes over what each crew skill and perk does for you in battle and whether or not it is useful to use on a specific tank crew. You'll find a link in the description below to this video. This has been Mobius Y. Thanks very much for watching and I'll see you on the battlefield.